Hi friends, welcome to testing to Tara's point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about our next session that is apply with how to install our setup for install and set up for private okay how to do it in this format and i'm going to take there are two ways i'm going to show you one is visual studio code editor how to install and do that and i'm going to do this entire playlist by using python okay and visual studio code and as well as i'm going to use for pycharm PyCharm and the both the places how we can able to integrate this one and how we can able to implement our playweight into here. Okay, basic two concepts I'm going to show you. Okay, these are the two and later point we'll see for how we can able to work with that uh, first programming creation and all. Okay, first I'm going to show you first we need to install our Python into our local then only we can able to do it for this i done for complete playlist into my python location please go through that how to install python into your system which version you can able to take and i'll uh, explain into clearly into my previous videos which is playlist for python related one if you go to my playlist you can see there is a playlist for python related one and I done the so many playlists for this and you can able to go through that one by one. You can here yeah, Python with Selenium. This is a playlist to complete and anything if you take and there I showed that complete information about for how to install our Python into your local. Okay, please go through that video. Okay, because it will take more time, uh, like uh, both the cases I need to install it because I have already installed into my local. That's why I am not able to show you one more time installation, but I'll show you the steps how to install into your local. Okay, but you can able to see in my uh, videos also, you can able to learn that one. Okay, if you type Python download, it will uh, show you this one. Okay, then you can able to take the latest version of Python or else you can able to see there are stable versions presented here and based upon that you can go to down and you can able to see the which version you want the stable version you can able to choose any one of them here you can able to click for download it will go to navigate into another page and here you need to download based upon your window system operating system 64 bit R. 30 uh, bit uh, installed uh, if you want you can based upon that you can able to download that particular one once you click the link it will download into your local once it is downloaded you have to click double click on that particular exe then it will start for downloading and you need to take care about that how it will download and where it is downloaded and everything the step by step it will show you and you can follow the steps and in my previous video you can do it and also you have to do for environment setup also that also i showed you to my previous video please go through that also once you've done the python installation and set up everything then you have to do for there are two another two tools one is visual studio code editor and pycharm any one you can able to install okay I'm going to show you two of them and you need, uh, you can based upon your convenient and based upon your system and based upon your feeling, you can install any one of them, okay? No, no issues, which is both the cases are very easy to install the plugins. Uh, it will not take much time and also it is not take the much space also. In Google, you have to search for PyCharm, okay? In the PyCharm, you need to download that also I show into my previous videos and you can follow that you can able to achieve like you can able to uh, understand those things to install how we can able to and here you have to uh, choose for community editor once you download and you have to double click that particular PyCharm one and you need to start installation it will not take much time it will quickly can able to install okay this is installation about for PyCharm that also I done for the playlist okay in the playlist i done okay for installation of uh, intellij for the software tools is there one package 
okay uh, before you watching this video it will be available for you okay how to install uh, IntelliJ it is presented okay and also we can able to say visual studio code editor also installation is presented you can able to see and i'm going to do for not for visual studio code editor i'm going to show you IntelliJ because i have facing some issue uh, in IntelliJ uh, not IntelliJ uh, visual studio code editor small uh, issue is happening in my system uh, be, uh, for that, I'm going to show you for IntelliJ and later video sessions time, I will show you for Visual Studio Code Editor how to integrate with this Playwright also, okay? Meanwhile, these two uh, I'll show you, okay? For this particular uh, installation of uh, IntelliJ also I done in the tools place, you can able to see that two videos, okay? And uh, once you install the PyCharm, Python, uh, IntelliJ, Okay, once you've done the three things, no, two things, only Python, any, any one of IDE. IDE because we need to edit our code. For that, we need to use for any one of them ID, IntelliJ or PyCharm. Any one you can able to install. Once you've done the installation, that you need to search with that. Playwright devs. Once you went into that here in the Python location, you can see the doc will be present. You have to choose which version you want. I have already choose that's so why default it is coming here. And you have to choose Python version. Okay. Once you choose the Python version, okay, it will be presented the doc and you need to click the doc and installation setups. There are two things you have to do. One is pip install pytest iPhone playwright is the one and playwright installed. Playwright is this one is adding for the plugin into the uh, py, uh, Python. And this playwright install is by using for browser navigations. We need to work with the browser site. For that, we need to use for this playwright install. These two things we need to do. First copy this uh, particular command and I'm going to paste it into here. First one. Okay, the same thing I'm going to do it for in the command prompt. Okay, in my case, I already installed into my system. It will show you the requirement is already installed, satisfy, and in your case, it will show you for installation. Okay, successful. So in my case, it is showing for requirement is already satisfied. Okay, in your case, it will show for installation everything successful. Okay, after that, you have to use for this particular playwright install. These two commands, you have to do it. Once you've done these two commands, then let's come to our PyCharm first. We'll go for PyCharm. Okay, in the PyCharm, I'm going to I'm going to create for new project. In the new project, I'm going to use for testing underscore play okay nothing to worry anything and you can able to create here once you create it will start for uh, a create a virtual uh, system virtual environment it is created and everything is presented right now okay then once you've done this particular one let wait a couple of minutes. Yeah, now everything is done. But we need to communicate with this particular playwright and Python inside the Python we install, right? By using PyTest. But in here also, you have to communicate with that playwright, right? Then how to communicate and how to do it means we need to use the file settings inside the settings project interpreter and project interpreter and we have to click for here python sorry plus and uh, pytest iphone playwright and once you see here it is highlighted here playwright okay the playwright will be presented there are playweights is there playweight some version and snapshot and everything but don't uh, go ahead for that 
this also one more thing is there but don't go that particular one pi test iphone private okay click on installation it will start for installation into your system Okay, once it is done in the installation, we'll uh, get for success message, no success message. Just a console and okay. Okay, create one file because we are creating by using uh, PyTest, right? For that, we need to use for same format. Here is like a uh, PyTest I already explained into my videos. Please go through that PyTest related information. And here's that there are some set of rules for PyTest to create your file and functions. It is basically test the starting position or ending position we have to provide for test. Okay, after that we have to use the underscore or something like without underscore also you can able to create with underscore also we can able to create. Underscore demo I'm providing, okay. And here whether it is installed by test is like a private is in your system or not. Yeah, uh, whether you are able to communicate or not, how we can able to check means we can able to use for from. Once you make it for PL, then it will show you private. Once you are able to see this particular private, you are able to install your private into this particular PyCharm location. Okay, this is a one condition and second condition we can able to do for IntelliJ also. How to do for IntelliJ? Open IntelliJ application. Uh, ID and create the new project. Okay, choose the Python, the same version, and you can able to use for demo underscore play. Okay, and create it. Once you create, it will start for uh, installation like virtual system environment. It will create and everything. Okay, don't worry about it. It will take care of what entire backend. Nothing to worry, and uh, you can able to see is created for sample also. But we can able to whether uh, we can uh, first we need to create for one sample uh, file whether we can able to do it or not. There are two ways we can able to add it for plugin here, and here there is no uh, related to uh, settings inside the settings. There is no particular file uh, like uh, settings. And here there is no project interpreter. Okay, you can see that right? there are uh, all the things, but it will not be presented project interpreter here. For due to that, we can able to use the plugins place. Here we can able to use for play with. This not comes. It is not coming here. We can able to do it one more time. Like here, I will create one file first. <clears throat> Test underscore demo. Okay, this is my file and I can do one thing here from play right. Okay, and you can able to see here. Add to install the package, install package wait, just install the package and we can able to install into our package here. It will start for installation of the package. Okay, now the package is successfully installed. Now you can see the error is gone. Now if you remove here from playweight, automatically playweight will come here, playweight. Okay, this is a one uh, installation about for playweight in uh, PyCharm and IntelliJ and Python and in your locus setup. Okay, installation and setup for Play with in the combination of selling uh, PyCharm and IntelliJ. Okay, I hope you understand this one. Please like my video, please subscribe my YouTube channel, and don't forget to share your friends and colleagues. Thank you.